What's going on, everyone? Might go back, and the time has come to break a box, one hobby box of 2021 Allen and Ginter Topps Chrome Edition. Super excited to break this product. Allen and Ginter, I'm a big fan. Many of you who have followed the channel for years are well aware of that. Just love the look of Ginter every year. Like many, last year when they announced Ginter Chrome was coming out, I kind of scratched my head. I kind of said, is that really necessary? Well, 2020 Allen & Ginter Chrome was a beautiful product, one of my top favorite products of last year. The cards look beautiful, the refractors, the shine, all looked incredible. This year, Ginter Chrome is back. Some more color par parallels to look for. Uh, you have X-Fractors that are one per case. Autographs are only one per case, so it's tough to pull some of the big stuff, but you do get a couple color cards uh, in every box. You get one mini per pack. You have mini inserts, mostly baseball. Obviously, you have some non-sports mixed in, but 300-card checklist, it's definitely tough to pull certain things, but it's a lot of fun. Cards look great. Got some nice rookies in here. They've updated it, so it's not just a rehash of 2021 20, Allen and Ginter. They've updated players in updated uniforms, stuff like that. Four cards per pack, 18 packs per box. I'll be breaking a solid amount of it, but wanted to make sure I did at least one on camera. So let's see how I do. I know my buddy Reese ND Card Ranger had ordered a box. He was telling me he's going to be breaking one. I'm not sure if he'll do it on camera or if maybe he'll show a recap or something, but check out Reese's channel. Also, JT, Triple Crown 24, he broke a case, and he has that published on his site, so if you want to see the breakdown out of a case, check out Triple Crown 24. Box looks solid. Packs pretty nice. So we'll see... How we do overall. So, like I said, you have a chance to find chrome autograph cards. Uh, the chrome, the autographs, they're all going to be chrome, are only one per case. And X Fractors, one per case. You have a chance to get Super Fractors. I believe they're like maybe one in five or six cases. And if we have different color parallels. Refractors 1 and 3, X-Fractors blue, green, gold, orange, red, Superfractors, mini base, mini gold, orange, red, Superfractors, full-size autographs. Then you got World Leaders, Rookie Design Variation, and World's Largest as some mini inserts. So let's get into pack number one see how we do it's my first chance to see these in person obviously i've seen some on camera and they do look very nice lewis patino will be our first card We've got a reggie jackson sweet looking chrome reggie jackson one change from last year all the minis are refractors last year the mini Parallels were just minis. Of course, our first mini is not the ideal one. And Garrett Crockett. So that is pack number one. All right, pack two Hall of Famer Al Kaline. Lucas Giolito, Refractor. You can see the Refractor shine in the mirror behind him. So our first Refractor. There's a nice mini. That's the uh, rookie insert set, which is the variations, Jerry Kellenick. So it's a nice one there. And we got a Stan the Man, Stan Musial. This will definitely be a quick break. 18 packs, but only four cards. So you can get through them quick. David Wright. There's a blue, blue refractor of Anthony Rizzo. Blue numbered to 150. Blue look pretty nice. All right, we got a mini. 
Willie Castro. Then we got a Will Craig. So the parallels and inserts, they're pretty tough pulls. Even the minis. I mean, you're only going to get so many per box. Keep in mind, you're going to get a couple of the rookie variation inserts. You're going to get the world leaders. So what are you going to get? 14 minis per box. So it take you like three, four cases to uh, pull them all. All right, Flaherty, Nakin, Altuve Mini. Looks like an orange refractor. Basabi. So it's another color, orange, number to 25, Jose Altuve. So a little mini color action there. Anthony Rizzo base refractor of Kim Ning world leader from Norway Solberg and then we've got a Brooks Robinson base really a beautiful looking product pricey to break but not crazy I certainly, if you're a player or team collector, highly recommend chasing at least part of the rainbows. Jeff Garland. Mark Anthony Mini. And we have a Casey Mize rookie. Definitely some solid rookies in the product as well. These cards definitely look great in person. Ramon Laureano, Christian Pache rookie card. Rangham. I do think Inter could have done a little better job with the celebrities this year. World's largest. So there's the world's largest rock. All right, we are almost at the halfway point of the box. Dallas Keuchel. Rojas. Sweet Jackie Robinson. We got a Andrew McCutcheon mini. Andrew McCutcheon. Had a nice little run with the Phils. He is a free agent, so we'll see where he ends up in 2022. Clark Schmidt rookie, Kelly, world leader, Moon from South Korea, Sixto Sanchez rookie card, all right, first half of the box, first half, we got one orange mini, and one blue refractor, a couple refractors, a couple inserts, so we'll see what, if anything else, we get, Pardo. Hit an auto, definitely not expe not expected. Nolan Arenado. So Arenado, obviously a fantastic player. Uh, autograph checklist is bigger this year. Last year, I think it was more like 25. Uh, this year, it's expanded to 45. Overall, checklist is pretty solid. There are a few really rough rookies to hit. And there's definitely some incredible autographs. So Arenado is probably right in the middle. I'm certainly going to take it. I will absolutely take that. I mean, just to hit an auto is great. Especially, this isn't even out of a full case. This is out of a selection of a few boxes. So that's pretty sweet. Let me put that to the side. There's a Casey Mize mini variation insert. And Smith. So this box is definitely a winner there. Because like I said, that is a case hit, one per case. Grandal, Garrett Cole, Casey Mize, regular mini. And this is a much tougher pull than the insert. The insert, probably one per case. You're definitely not guaranteed um, one out of a case of these. Austin Meadows. There are a few fills on that autograph checklist. 
We got Andrew McCutcheon, Bryce Harper, which would be a big pickup for the collection, and Mike Schmidt as well this year. And then you have like your Mike Trout. You have some of the uh, superstars in there. World's largest honey fungus. I mean, the card looks beautiful. I mean, I don't know how many people want to collect the honey fungus card, but they'll, there's a market out there for that stuff. I kind of wish they did the sharks. I think they would have looked great in the chrome version. Santo. Juan Gonzalez refractor. Mini. Christian Pache. And a Cabrian Hayes rookie. So nice rookie card there of Cabrian Hayes. Print run is definitely not very high on this set. I think one of the estimates I saw, and I didn't verify it or anything like that, but was about 6,000 base. There's a Mike Trout. Gorgeous card. Oh, Lou Gehrig, what a pack. Zach Greinke, Ryan Jeffers, mini. All right, handful of packs left. Probably not much more to expect. Hit some color. Hit a little auto action. Okay. We'll take a green refractor there of Cal Ripken Jr. So we're not done with the color yet. Number to 99. Then a Eddie Murray refractor. Very cool. Mini a Sofer. And our first base card of the pack, Freddie Freeman. All right, last few packs. We'll see what else we get. Maybe a rookie card or something. Arenado Base, Mookie Betts, Lou Bob, and Lee from Singapore, World Leaders. This would definitely be a fun set to put together, but it'd be a pricey set. I mean, I think cost on these cards is about $2.50 per card. Brickley, Kirloff, a rookie. So nice rookie there. Mini Mike Trout, very cool. Mini Trout. And... All right, final pack. Wrap this box up. Lorenzo Kane, Garrett Cole, Refractor, Mini Billy Williams, and a base of Warren Spawn. So, this is what you got out of that box. A stack of base, not incredibly large, handful of refractors, got five refractors, Small stack of minis, including some star names. Insert wise, we got three world leaders, two world's largest. Two mini variations. One mini orange. Two full size color. We got a green and a blue. And super lucky hitting an auto of Nolan Arenado. So, a very successful box break of 2021 Allen and Ginter Chrome. Check it out. Super fun. I enjoyed it. Prices not too bad right now. We'll see. Prices may rise eventually, but right now there's still a lot of product coming out. Competing with basketball and football in the prime of their seasons. And of course, baseball being in an offseason with a lockout, with more products to come. That certainly makes it tough, but hey, that's good for the baseball collectors out there. Comment below, let me know what you guys think, and I will talk to you next time. Have a great one.